What up, everybody? Tim Carthon, the Fiery Truth Teller here. And normally this is fight video time, where I post the next video in my hashtag It's Time to Fight video series. But today is a special day, so I wanted to talk directly to you about the severity of it. Now, earlier today, Donald J. Trump became the 45th President of the United States coming in with one of the lowest, if not the lowest, approval ratings of any president in history. Before he won the presidency, he was already the most disliked candidate in history. But you know who was number two? Secretary Hillary Clinton. Now, this video is not about throwing salt in the wound of Secretary Clinton. She's a historic figure and if I met her one day, I'd be very cordial to her as long as she's no longer in public office or is doing no one any harm. However, as far as her unfavorables went, she was the second most disliked candidate in history because everyone could see clearly that her arrogance and hubris made her think that she could do anything in the public eye, but something different behind closed doors and that wouldn't stop her rise to the presidency because the other general election candidate was disliked more than her. She never fully accepted that her primary rival, Senator Bernie Sanders, had awoken a sleeping citizen giant and that her 90s era political playbook had become obsolete. We could see that she wasn't primarily attempting her runs at the presidency for we the people but instead for herself because, you know, you're supposed to be with her, not her with you, because her being with you was irrelevant to her ambitions. And that arrogance and hubris, that selfishness, has brought us this new president. And where are his two biggest former campaign rivals? Well, the great senator from Vermont is out fighting harder than ever. He's fighting harder than I've ever seen him for we the people right now. And Madam Secretary? Well, she's nowhere to be found. She's MIA, figuratively speaking. Neighborhood Watch is looking for her. SEAL Team 6 is probably on standby. Her face is on the back of a million milk cartons. I mean, she's not a kid, but they might need to put out an Amber Alert for her too. And why is that? why do you think that is? It's because, again, the presidency for her was about and for her, not you. Just like the Clinton Global Initiative was in large part a pay-for-play operation. Notice I said was. Yeah, because two months after Secretary Clinton lost the U.S. presidential election for the second and hopefully final time, almost all the charitable donations, percentage-wise, dried up for CGI. Hmm, that's weird. I thought it was about charity. What, did people all of a sudden stop caring about world issues, poverty, etc.? Of course not. They were giving CGI money because they were expecting favors in return because they figured she'd be in a position of power to be able to continue to grant those favors. And when she lost the election, and thereby the power her charitable givers hoped she would attain, she lost the donations to CGI too. This is why we have to get a constitutional amendment to get money out of politics. Because until the money is gone, 98% of politicians will just say what it is they think we want to hear, but then do the exact opposite of what they said when they get elected. Just like what Donald Trump has done so far. Lean heavily towards the ridiculously rich people who and multinational, multi-billion dollar corporations that gave him money. And that's what we have to stop. I had to take this time out to express my feelings about this as we start today what is shaping up to be one of the most tumultuous periods in American history. Because if primaries hadn't have been rigged and news outlets had have done their actual jobs, this day would never have occurred. Thanks Democratic and Republican parties and corporate media, you did a bang up job for the American people. 
So be sure to check me out at TimCarthon.com and on social media at Tim Carthon. The next episode of my fight series will be uploaded next Friday as scheduled. So be sure to like this video and click the subscribe button and the bell next to it so you can get my new video upload notifications. It's time to fight, people. Let's get it.